Everyone talks about digital transformation, right? As one of many, not only buzzwords, but initiatives, massive undertakings for most businesses. And it really comes down from the fact that too many of us have been complacent for too long. Somebody else coming in from the outside, disrupting your business model, your existence is, you know, taken into question in some degrees. And people are finally understanding to leverage not only technology, but actually change the way they're operating. Digital transformation is not about digitizing your processes. It's not a tech initiative, even though technology executives play a critical role in driving this process, which in many cases is never ending forward to fruition. Prerequisites to transform digitally, right? Not just digitizing a form or current experience, it are executive leadership and organizational culture. It is extremely important to have the buy-in and support from the very top and not just coming in, sending one email to the community, to your business and saying, hey, we're doing X, you know, see you in a year. No. Town hall meetings, open forums, emails, exchanges, that same common golden thread throughout meetings and other initiatives that that business or that organization undertakes in the following year or two or three. It's putting the funding where it needs to be, leading people in that direction. It's staffing those areas and initiatives. It's creating strategic partnerships where they are absolutely needed and critical because you may not have the skill set in-house or you may not want to be in that business in today's world and environment. So prerequisites to digital transformation are actually leadership and culture. You need to have them both calibrated at an optimal level for digital transformation along with many other initiatives to even be successful, right? Culture eats strategy for breakfast, as Peter Drucker used to say. And leadership communicates and sets the tone for what is tolerated, accepted, and what is the norm in how we do business today. So having executive leadership be actively engaged in the process of shaping the overall culture, which takes many, many, many years in many instances, is what is needed for one organization to completely reimagine how they do business from customer acquisition to partnering, marketing, research, product development, service improvements, and so forth, right? It is a global undertaking that is really a business initiative powered and driven to some extent by technology and delivered by technology, but it really is a business global overall process that needs to take place. It's not IT getting something assigned to them and everybody else retreats in their offices or cubicles until this thing is done and we have all been transformed successfully. So just wanted to share that uh, because I see it a lot and um, it is really important to understand The leadership and culture play a role in anything and everything we do. Whether we like it or not, whether we want to admit it or not, they both do and they're both extremely important. Have a wonderful day. I wish you all the best. And as always, if this is the first video you see, please consider subscribing below and sharing it with those in your networks who you believe should see this video. Have a wonderful day.